Hello friends, uh, welcome again and uh, this is my new project online crime reporting system and I have developed this project in PHP and MySQL. The version for the PHP I am using is the PHP version 7 and the MySQL version is 5.6 and um, I am running this project on the Jam server but if you are using the WAMP server or other PHP based Apache based MySQL based server then you can run this project also on those softwares. Also, if you are using the Linux environment, then you can configure this project on the LAMP. And if you are using the Mac, op book, uh, Mac operating system, then you can configure this project on the MAMP server site. Right? So this is all about the operating systems and the database and the server side scripting. For front end, I am using the HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Some of the jQuery library also I have used, like form validations sliders and many more things i have used the jquery plugins right so let's start the project functionality so the project title is online crime reporting system and this is a major project which i have developed in php and mysql so let's start so this is the home page of the project so you, this is a three user based system right the first one is the super admin the second one is the police and third one is the user right the admin has the super rights the police user has the minimal rights and the normal user member has the very minimal right right means the member can submit the means submit his complaint and he can see the report of it right so let's start so this is the home page of the project you can see this is a simple home page this is the about project right if you want to change the content then you can change directly from the about.php this is the all criminals so this is a, uh, there is a uh, admin panel there is a form in admin panel where you can add the criminal details right so you can see all of the criminal details here if you click on the image then you will be able to see all of the details of that criminal right so this is a criminal details and if you click on the view crimes currently there is no crime associated with this criminal then you will be able to see the crimes of this criminal right so you can see this is the crime report right this is a log complaint from where you will be able to log complaint but for logging the complaint you must have the user id and password right so the user id is i think the customer and test uh, so let me check in the database uh, what's the user id and password uh, it's a user or test so user and test no so let me check so if you don't have the user id and password then you can register yourself through the registration form and after that you will be able to access the system and you will be able to means uh, report the complaints right so the user id is member and test right so the user id is member and the password is test so once you click on the login then you will get the user dashboard from here you will be able to log the complaints right this is the log complaint here you need to enter the title in the police station right this drop down is dynamic and the value of this drop down is coming from the database the full address and full details of your complaint right so this is a dashboard so from first link you will be able to log the complaint in my complaint you will be able to see the complaints status right so you can see you have logged five complaints and what is the status of so it's color coding if it's in progress then there will be different and there is a pending here right so if police user and admin or admin user update the status then the color of this uh, status will be changed automatically right this is the all police stations all of the police stations which is available in the database will be displayed here right this is a submit feedback this is a site feedback if you submit the feedback here then admin will be able to see those feedback right this is the dashboard again view articles books so all of the article books uh, which has been uploaded by admin or the police user you will be able to see here even you can download it right and you can download and read it right so just click on the download to download and read it right so this is the my account from where you will be able to update your account password right so this is a submit you can see your account has been successfully updated this is a change password from where you will be update your account password right and after changing the password you will be able to log inside the system with that updated password right so 
this all functionality I have explained to you. So this is the dashboard for the member, right? So there is two more user. I will log in with those user and will this will show the functionality performed by those users, right? So once you click on the logout, then above menu will be changed. And this is a session driven menu. It comes according to the session level, right? So once you log out, then you can see the say the menu has been changed. So if you log in again, then the second user is police, right? So let me explain this one first, right? So this is the register from where you will be able to register inside the system. If you don't have the user and password, then you will be able to register, but you will be registered only and only as a normal member, right? For logging the complaint and see the complaint status. This is a login from where you will be able to log inside the system. And this is the submit feedback. The single login form will be used by all of the users, but the internal functionality will be changed according to the login level, right? So the user ID, the next user is police. So once you log in with the police, then you can see this number of action police can perform, right? So let me go through one by one. So add crime from here you will be able to add the crime. So this all drawdown, there are four dropdowns here, right? And all of the dropdowns is dynamic, right? So the value of these dropdowns are coming from the database. So you can change, update, delete the value of these dropdowns. There is no need of changing the codes, right? Just go and update the value in the database or from the form, those values will be updated, right? The second one, the same, the same thing, the same menu option is available here also, right? So let me go through one by one, add criminal. So from this form, you will be able to add the criminals, right? If you add any criminals here, then those criminals details will be available on the home page also, right? Means without logging, you will be able to see all of the criminal details. This is the add police station from where you will be able to add the police stations. This is the add category from where you will add the category means crime category, murder, stolen, this type of things. This is the add article book from here. You will be able to upload the article books, right? So I already explained you the article book from where you were able to download the book. So from here, you will be able to add the article book, but article book will be uploaded by the police, right? So this is the article book reports. So in reports, there are this number of reports are available. So all police stations and uh, police user will be able to see all of the police stations. He can edit it and update it also, right? And then this one, all police station. This one is the all police user report. So there are five police users available in the database. So this is all police user report, right? This one is the all member report. All of the registered member will be displayed here. So if anyone new member registered on this website, then those details will be displayed here. All category report, all of the category added by the police user will be displayed here. You can see there are six categories. This is the all complaints. All of the complaints will be displayed here. So suppose this is the pending, right? Once he click in the view, then here you can change the status in progress. So this is money issues. Once you click on the submit, you can see it's in the progress, right? So if you click on the again and it's a solved, then you will be able to get the solved status, right? You even you can delete it also all complaints this is the all feedback all of the feedback which has been uh, entered by the user will be displayed here right you can see all of the feedback here right this is the all crime report right all of the crime will be displayed here right all of the criminal reports all of the criminal which you have added will be displayed here so you can see this is the criminal details even you can edit and update the details this is a view article books all of the article books you can display you can find it here right but there is an extra edit and delete parameter here but in the member panel you will not get this edit and delete parameter because that those member doesn't have the access to edit delete and add the article books right you can edit it and you can delete update the things from here also this is the my account from where you will be able to you will be able to update your account details right this is a change password from where you will be able to change your password in the logout. So once you log out, then all of the session will be destroyed. The last user is the admin. So once you log in with the admin, then this is a dashboard, right? So most of the functionality is same, but admin user will be able to add police user also, but police user will not be able to add the police user, right? So this is the same thing. So add police. So you can see this is the add police, right? 
and here add crime already explained you this is the admin means this is a super admin this is add crime add criminal add code right so this is a drop down so you will get this drop down code drop down in the add criminal add criminal page right so you can see sorry add crime so you can see this is the code and this is a prison right this these uh, prison and code details will be added from here add prison add category right add code type add article books right so the reports are same for both of the things that so you can see these are the number of reports this is a change password and the logout right so admin can perform extra functionalities as comparison to police user and the member sites right? admin is a super user police has the restricted some restricted rights and member has some restricted rights right so these all functionalities i have developed inside this project online crime reporting system as i told you earlier there are three types of user available in this project the first one is the police second one is the super admin and third one is a member member can register and log a complaint and check the complaint status only right he can check the uh, article books he can submit the feedback right so this all functionality i have developed right? so if you need more functionality in this period just put it into the comment i will incorporate the changes i will make this project more better and better according to your requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much